fresh off the family day long weekend, and in fine conditions, the sun was shining on the Kingston Dock. Work continued on the extension of the North Finger Dock to remove the forms used in concrete casting. On the South Finger Dock, there was less evidence of activity, but the utility building roof was receiving attention. This turned out to be the removal of the temporary roof. An explanation became readily apparent next morning, the arrival of a crane and its supporting flatbed vehicle. Just after 10 o'clock, a large, probably air storage cylinder, was lifted into the east end of the building. Note that another is to come. Operations like this can't be hurried. Precise placement is important. You only want to perform the operation once. With the cylinder placement still underway, a large air compressor was backed up towards the crane. The second cylinder was already in place when a large, indeterminate object lifted off. In the background here, you can see some of the concrete slabs delivered on the 13th. And if you stick around to the end, you may see more. It was the turn of the air compressor to be rigged for lift next. Stretchers were inserted between the straps to reduce the risk of crushing. You can gauge how well things have gone when I tell you that that's the 11.30 sailing behind. When liftoff comes, it's inevitably smooth and controlled. On a pretty windy day, the whole operation has done nothing but earn respect for the crane operator, his apprentice, and the whole crew involved. During a busy morning, Everything has gone really well. But the day is still young. Let's see what the afternoon holds. Can these be concrete slabs lined up on Queen Street? It seems the second six of 12 deck slabs have arrived. That's a cargo weighing something in the region of 70,000 pounds. Skilled drivers make light of limited manoeuvring space. The width of the load drives the need for several ground guides. With one load reversed into position, the second waits patiently on the dock. And then takes its place. Unloading of the slabs is quickly and efficiently conducted. Confirmation by the riggers that the attachments are absolutely secure leads very quickly to the go signal.
Once again, a smooth, controlled movement is assured by the crane operator. Skilled hands wait to guide each slab as it descends. The day has been a great success, and there are many more to come. If you want to keep up to date with what's happening on the dock, please consider subscribing. And thanks for watching this update.